Hey everyone, welcome to another taste test. So today I'm gonna to do the simple truth. These two ice cream bars that I found, they were $3.50 each, they were on sale. They're normally $3.99. Um, they are a little, little pricey because you only get three of them. But um, they're both plant-based slash vegan. I'll tell you that on the front. Um, and then this one kind of reminds me of one that I absolutely love. So I wanted to kind of see what it tastes like compared to this one. This is from Target. I'm not really necessarily doing a taste test on this because I've eaten these a lot. But um, they, you get four of them and they're normally, I think like, well, they were 450, they went up another 50 cents. I think they're just having a hard time getting these because it's been really hard for me to get them. But um, yeah, they're really good. And so that's about the same price you get for this, but yeah, you don't get as many, but it's about the same price. So you're spending a little over a dollar for them. So I'm gonna try this one first, just so, cause I'm gonna compare these two. Uh, so let me just read kind of the facts on both of these real quick. You, they both have two grams of protein. One has, uh, both have 17 grams. So this one includes um, four extra grams of sugar. And this one's only three grams. Um, they both have 23 grams of carbs. This one has 45 grams of sodium and this one only has 25. So that's interesting. Zero grams of cholesterol, everything vegan will be zero grams of cholesterol. Now that doesn't mean things can't turn into cholesterol, but right up front, you're not getting cholesterol. Total gram, total fat is 10, as total fat is 13, saturated is 10 of both. Trans zero. So yeah, they're, you know, of course you're eating these and they're not like the greatest, but you're getting some calcium, you're getting 12, you're getting um, two milligrams of iron and three, and then you're getting 80 potassium and 100, uh, 165 potassium. This one, that's crazy. So, and if you want to just read the ingredients, so they both contain coconuts, and then they warn you they may contain peanuts and you know, other things that cause allergens. And it tells you on the box to recycle it. Because I've heard different things about recycling. I've heard if they're frozen, they don't want you to recycle them. But on here it says please recycle. So that's what I'm going to do when this box is empty. All right, so I think they're both made with coconut milk. I'm actually not sure. Let me see. Because it's showing a little coconut right there. So I'm thinking they're with coconut milk. But this also says that they have dark chocolate or dark cocoa, made with sustainable dark cocoa. But the but the ice cream itself is probably made with coconut milk. But let me see. Coconut oil, coconut cream. There we go. That's where it's coming from. So that's why I think they put the coconut on there. Alright, so and this one is made with oat. It's oat based. Anyway. Okay, so let's try this one first since this is the, not comparing it to anything. And these actually expire way over a year than when I got them. So I got them over the weekend and they say they expire in next year, in July of next year. So I still have a really long time, but yeah, once you probably open the box, it's not as sustainable. All right, so here's what it looks like. So, you know, they are a little small. Uh -oh. Ever fall apart. I need to do this fast. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, they're already falling apart. So be careful if you have a little babies, little doggies that could eat this stuff. Okay, so I'm just gonna try a quick bite. Oh boy. They are honestly just falling apart everywhere. It's not bad. It just kind of tastes like chocolate. Nothing like extremely special. I know I've had it sitting out for just like a few minutes that I've been talking, but kind of crazy. It's like falling apart. I don't know if it's just because I've waited a little longer to eat it, but yeah. Let's see how this one is. Now, I know what these taste like, but I'm going to try this one so I'm just like kind of blinded by it. And I'll taste that one and compare it. And these, like, these never fall off so maybe it's just not as sustainable all right so 
Yeah, and it looks a lot like that one. This one, that one usually has these little like raspberry looking chunks, but these are strawberry and raspberry. It looks like strawberry, raspberry, and blueberry. So this one just looks like blueberry and raspberry, the favorite day ones. And these ones look like they have a little bit more. They're chocolate raspberry. And these are forest fruit and raspberry. So let's just see. All right, let's see if it all falls apart. It's already cracking. It's already cracking on like both sides. So I'm gonna scare here. And it's a lot more sustainable. I, uh, what I remember, it almost is exactly like that one. So if you can't find these ones, try getting these ones. Mm. Yeah, I think it tastes just like this one, but we'll try it here in just a second to really compare. It's just as flavorful. But out of these two, I'd get this one. This one was just kind of like just chocolate. I mean, if you really like chocolate, you might really like it. I do, but it just wasn't anything like special to me. And it fell apart. I'm actually curious if this one may be... Yeah, it looks the same on the box too, honestly. Looks about the same pink color. They did kind of the same thing with the with the shell. It has like the raspberries in the shell. And honestly, grabbing these, I probably won't even know the difference. See, yeah, it looks almost exactly the same. It's probably about the same size. Yeah, because I ate what probably about that much off. So it's like maybe this one's a little darker. Like if you look at it in the light a little better. Yeah, this one's a little darker, but I think they're exactly the same size. I think they taste pretty much the same. Mm -hmm. Oh, what? I think this one might taste better. Hold on. Oh my god, I hate to say that. I honestly think this one has a little bit more flavor. Let me try this one again. Yeah. Hey. I think these are the best ice cream because I've been eating these for a while. And I don't know, them being vegan is so shocking that it could taste this good. But you know what? I think this has a little bit more flavor in the ice cream itself. Mm hmm The taste comes through a little bit more. Hmm. So I would probably have to go with this one actually. On comparison, of these two, I'd probably have to go with this one. So, that's crazy. But, with that being said, yeah, you can see they look almost exactly the same color pink. I think this one's a little darker. It's a little harder to tell on camera. But this one looks a little darker. Not much, honestly. They're like... So, if you can't find one or the other, at least one would be a good substitute for the other. But, yeah. Well, as I said, this is the winner overall. Yay. Check it out. Do your own taste test if you know try them in, in comparison to these if you want. Let me know what you think. If you had these a lot, like I have, and then you're trying this one, yeah, you'll I think you'll taste the difference. That's why I like tasting them side by side too, because then I will really know. Alright, well thank you for watching. I hope you like, share, subscribe. I will see you in my next taste test or video. Bye!